We're at the 301. Got a rainstorm to the west of us. We're gonna try to go on State Road 50, which is nuts. I just drove over there and the shoulder is not very wide. I forgot to put my flashers on. Let's try to do that at the light. And there, I'll probably the sidewalk goes. That's an idea right there, man. I didn't even look at that. Get my flashers on. I didn't see how far the sidewalk goes. It looks like it goes just up to that same place where the construction is, right next to 301. So we drove down to, um, we drove on Brew Well down to 301. We actually entered Pasco County. That's how far down it went, like three miles. I think it was 3.2 miles. So this is a cement path that comes from the Withlacoochee Trail um, over pedestrian over Pass Bridge that goes over State Road 50. That goes over State Road 50. This doesn't get go very far. It ends pretty much pretty close to the where the barricade is here. I mean, it's not like we can even sneak past this because there's not much past this. And then the dirt road is... Uh, the dirt road is too soft for our tires. So we have to jump in the bike lane once we get across this. Pretty dangerous, but it goes for like a mile. You can actually probably get off your bike and ride. Get get off your bike and walk on the left side of the road in the grass part, or you can try to ride it. This ends. It ends right here. It ends right here. And this is not like the worst time to go out and well not the worst time, it's not three o'clock yet. It will be in twenty-five minutes. You get little breaks like this. You get little breaks like that. booty not much of a shoulder on this I think I'm gonna wait I'm gonna wait here for a little bit I hear the cars coming I hear the cars coming we'll just wait especially after that truck A uh, long line, long line of cars coming. Then, then there's a break. When I last did this, it was after it was after lunch. It was like that was it, 11:30 or something like that. Looks like a huge break coming out. Look at this. Look at that, big break, big break. We're at point four five here. It's not 
too bad of a shoulder actually. I thought it was worse when I was driving. But there's parts where it gets really tight up ahead. behind me hitting 18 miles an hour we're a little scared here I'm not gonna lie you got the shoulder to walk on on the right here if you want to walk instead now here I'm gonna stop make sure got one car coming one truck one truck coming. <laughs> kind of forced out here. Another break. Let me go look over here. The dirt's hard here. The dirt is hard. It's been conditioned somehow. Ooh, look at this. Wow. A freaking road back here. And that's Bruel Road up ahead. And there's a trail up there. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it gets, it gets pretty bad in the next part of that. It gets a little tight. Whoa. This is cool. This is a phenomenon. Exclusive. I want to show you my tires. How skinny they are. You guys, a little thicker tire you might have. Better luck than I do here. As long as there's like grass or something, I can ride in it. Or... It's not too bad actually. But I say I was at 0.045. Oh man, I just missed the train. How exciting. How exciting. Beating just seeing that train go by me. Now I'm talking. Now let's see how long it is. I'm actually curious. It looks like there's, there's a dirt road back there, too. Looks like there's a dirt road over there. Let's go cruise back there and see what that's like. Since we're waiting for the train, we're not going to stop videoing. Here, we have to stop a little. Man, that would have sunk if I was on the road. Hope it ends soon. What timing? Total time six minutes and fifty seconds. Time of day two thirty nine. Split speed eight point eight miles per hour. So look, there's a dirt road back there. I'm curious about it now. I'm curious about it. Maybe we'll be back up the top in here a little bit. I just missed that. Let's go check this place out. Oh, look at that. I'm 
curious now. I'm curious now. It's a nice hard surface. It's a nice hard surface for the time being. It's got like gravel rocks or something. Man, if I knew about this. There's almost sunk in on that one. Whoop. Whoop. Getting stuck here. Let me go. Tires are getting a little stuck here. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna turn around because I'm I can't go any further with these tires. Oh. Well, it was good up until that point. It looks like it goes a long ways up there, so. Now, for some reason, I can't roll on this stuff. What's going on here? Why could I roll, roll one way and not the other way? That's weird, huh? Let's roll one way, but not the other way. Mystery, that's a mystery to me. A mystery. Well, Scoop, what do you think? <laughs> that's on Scooby. Okay, so we can't at least go that way on. I found this road to Bru well, which will take you to Asphalt Trail, but it's good here. Gotta push a little. Push a little near the saw blade. It's it hard again. Ooh. Point one point two seven miles there. I wish I'd seen this last week and I, I didn't know about the asphalt throw. I mean on the seventeenth on that. The eight eighteenth. The eighteenth. It was a day later after um St. Patrick's Day. Nice here. I should just stay in a grassy area. Better for my tires. Oh, oh, oh. So far, so good. <laughs> I just spoke too soon. I spoke too soon. Well, I didn't fall there because that was a rock. I mean, it's right there. I could pretty much just get off the bike and run. I hear construction trucks up on top of me. that'll work out here that'll work out here okay we're almost there what do we say? Get off in here. Walk a little. Because we're so close.
you're still recording i hope you are i'd be mad if i didn't get that coming up on brewer well road there's a steamroller there That would be the safer way to go, I, su I suppose. So this is a trail next to Cortez Boulevard. Today's date is March 27th, Wednesday. To Wednesday, 27th. I drove my vehicle um, down that road to 301 and it's about three miles. A very long road and there's no bike lane until you get towards 301 and it's 55 miles an hour in some places but it seemed okay when i was driving it claremont groveland 21 miles claremont 26 miles orlando 51 miles we're probably going to sneak back that way same way we came in past the, past the train tracks this is awesome isn't it check it out this is about i mapped it after i rode it this is about eight miles there's a guy on a tractor there probably gonna tell me something to ruin my video completely Nobody in there. Lucky me. So cool, huh? Cool. I mean, we're almost in three o'clock traffic. It's well, it's 250 right now, 250, 252 to be exact. So you know, you know the drill. Three o'clock traffic's the worst. What did what, what we hit? 184 there. We backtracked a little. Check out that other dirt road behind the the, um, the road going up. I don't know how far it is that I didn't record here, but I'm gonna ride up to the, the animal tunnel. There's an animal tunnel up ahead. I mean, way up ahead. Here comes the two miles. Total distance 2 miles. Total time 15 minutes and 45 seconds. Time of day 2.49. Split speed 6.7 miles per hour. Little disappointed that I didn't like ride on the road a little. That's what I drove all the way up here for to finish that part this is riverland road that we're crossing this is great isn't it this goes up about eight miles 8.3 miles, I believe. Just past the yellow horse. There's a yellow painted horse on in front of somebody's house way up there. Look 
this is great. I uh, can't wait till it's really officially open. I could do time warp, but I'm not going to. I really don't know how far that tunnel is up ahead. I don't see a wall going up or anything, that's what I'm looking at. That's how far I didn't record my video. And there's a vehicle coming my way. Shoot. I'll get off the road. Oh. Nope. He's cool. He's cool. Oh, look how pretty that is. Look how ugly this is behind us. The storm is a coming. I don't see the wall that had that tunnel on it, man. Woman, man and woman. Could have a good five mile ride here. Okay, it looks like the road might be going up a little bit there. Once I hit that tunnel, I can go back. On the left side of the road, there's more pavement. It's supposed to be a national um, walk. Let me look it up and I'll tell you what it was. I took a picture of it. Florida, Florida National Scenic Trail, Central Region. Which also goes to um, Clay Sink Road. Which is also part Total of Total distance 3 miles. Total time 20 minutes and 28 seconds. Time of day 254. Split speed 12.7 miles per hour. Which is also part of that Clay Sink Road. Clay Sink Road West. Yeah, so I came back to refilm some stuff because I missed it. Here, here you go, historic Rich Loam General Store. I didn't get to go. I didn't go to that the last time. I just rode right by it. Here comes that tunnel I was talking about. The animal, animal crossing tunnel. And it also goes to that scenic trail. Hope no bears or cougars or anything come out of it. Unless it's a woman. Let's check it out. What do you think? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, there's nothing coming through here. Ooh, man. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you will, look right here. <laughs> no bears are here. 
check it out. All right, there's a guy in a bulldozer over there. And I had my bright light on. Pretty cool. Yeah, that's for the animal crossing. Gives the animals a safe passage to cross there. Okay, I don't know how far that other that store is, that general store. That is here on the right. This is Rich Loam. Play Sink Road. Let's go check this out. I went straight ahead the last time. We're gonna have fun getting back to that Circle K back there on 301. We're at three mile, 3.5 miles here. On that mile, let's we'll see what we are on. 3.72 on Strava. Right, somebody shooting a gun here. That right, was a gun. Shoot! Hit me. A nice road. I gotta hustle to get back before it rains. So we're 3.5 miles into the ride. They said the rain would dissipate, so I don't know. The weather people are only 50% right. They're never 100% right. A nice road, isn't it? I asked that before, didn't I? Say nice because there's no cars on it. Coming up soon. That is not it. No stopping, no starting, no hunting. Historic Bridge Thumb General Store. Three eight two one nine. Rich Sloan General Store. Wonder how far these roads go. Man. Let's go get something in there. We need a bike rack back here. Cool, look at this old machine. Look at this old gas pump. Nineteen and a half cents for gas. Look at that. Sales tax four cents, so quarter. I have a feeling it's gonna rain pretty soon. So we're in the how old building, the 1928 building. I'm trying to imagine what my uncle used to tell me all the stories of the quarter gas and all that stuff. Yeah. Nice. Looks like it's gonna rain. I gotta hurry and get back to the. It looks like it doesn't. 
the 301. The people oh. people riding the C2C take that road here. Mm-hmm. It's, it's you're talking about this road. Uh, it goes across um, over to um, crosses 471 and uh, goes on that that way. Is that what we're talking about? I think so. I, I just know they get on a logger road somewhere. They do, they do, and it just around the corner it turns into hard lime rock road, and okay. then that's all I know. I don't know which bike trails they take. You know, right. I do carry cold drinks if you need something. Yeah, I would Diet Coke. I don't, no, I'm not carrying. <laughs> I do have water if you need a bottle. How about one of these? these are these, what I have cold. Are these okay. Mexican sodas? Uh-huh. Yeah, I'll have one of those. I like the Mexican Coke. So we turned around. Uh, we're heading back to 301. We're four miles into the ride. We were 4.28 miles right there. Gotta hustle because we got rain to the to the west of I-75 right now. And that's not too far from 301. That's like five miles. Hope we don't get caught in rain. It's amazing how fast my legs seem to roll when I gotta race against the rain. I'm more scared of the lightning than, than the rain. Might have to get in that tunnel. I feel a couple of raindrops. Not good. So the rain could hold off for 16 minutes and that'll be good. It's yellow rain, so on the radar, so it's a little bit more than light rain. I don't want to get drenched because I got my new newer shoes on. A better shoes on me. Regardless of what shoes I have on, I don't like getting any of them wet. That's cool, I got to go to the store. Now we're heading back. people coming from the Space Coast you can go straight um, there's a dirt road on the side of that um, wall up ahead it's pretty hard it's walkable at least shoot man I don't know if I should risk it going this way I gotta get back to the Circle K It's like 3.30, the worst time to be on the road. What happened? We missed the road at that crossing up there. Total distance 7 miles. Total time 41 minutes and 8 seconds. Time of day 3.31. Split speed 10.3 miles per hour. Okay, watch the traffic patterns at this time. We're going to get on the road. Just because I want to show you what it looks like on the other side. Probably not the smartest thing I've ever done, but probably not the dumbest. Looks like we got a huge break after that truck there. If we get across. If we can get across. I mean, we can always walk it the rest of the way back. Come on, give me a break here. This is Burwell Road. We 
got a thunderstorm coming our way, so we got to hustle. Got a little bike lane here. If it's as bad as the other side, because you can see there's hardly a bike lane on the other side. Freaking hope I don't get wet. Cars coming. A little bathroom here. Can I ride over here? Wait for another break. Well, that's not going to get me very far. Come on, mercy against rain here. This car would go a little bit slower. It would be helpful, right? After this truck, there's nothing. Let's go, let's go. Chop, chop. Freaking rain is coming. See how much room is on the other side? Hardly any. Kind of like this side, but worse. I uh, went to the. I went to the left, coming the other way to the train tracks. Once I crossed them. This is the most dangerous part coming from Groveland, this stretch here. Doesn't seem as bad coming from Groveland, but it's going on the other way. You see the dirt road on the left? That's just, the dirt's hard enough for my little tires going. Come on, let's beat the rain. I like adding drama to my video, but not too much. I don't like getting wet. Let's see where we're at here. Cars, cars coming. You saw it? Not too many cars were there. Now we got three cars. And a little break. Good break there. Let's get to the bike lane. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Sugar sand. I think the next car that passes me doesn't have his headlights on. When I rode to Groveland, it was, um, I had my flashers on my bike and a lot of the cars were going over the double yellow line. Just to avoid me, even though there's a lot of space here. Yeah, there's way more, way more space here on, than on the other side. I don't know if you just saw that lightning up there. We need to hit that traffic light up there. That's where my car is parked. The circle K.
I-75 knew something. I didn't read it. It might only be a half mile instead of a mile. Circle case coming up. Perfect, we made it. And the rain's coming, so I gotta hurry up and put my bike in the car. Go get a Scooby snack in here. Yep, it's coming. Just making it. Get my bike wash first. 